So this is part two of the touch screen uh, installations. And now you could take the light guiding plexiglass. Make sure it's clean. Could bet all this diffusion sheet. Make sure they're in the same order. And uh, if you look really carefully on those plastics on four sides, there's a special markings. So uh, you sh you shouldn't mark it put it in the wrong way because otherwise the sheet will not fit all the way inside on top of the uh, plexiglass. So make sure the glass is clean and then put it back. Just reverse the procedure like we just showed you at the beginning of the video. Um, you know, uh, use a long nose to put those to bend those metal clips. Make sure it holds the front metal film to the back of the plastic. Uh, as you can see on this video, on the bottom left side, there's a LED con converter with this uh, uh, ribbon cable. That's how when we cut the hole on the other side and make sure the ribbon cable comes out this side. On the previous video. We install a small, tiny circuit board back. Just be really careful. I said, as I said it before, um, don't try to uh, apply any forces. Otherwise, if you break this connector, the screen's gone. Carefully put it back, and one more connector needs to be connect the ribbon cable, and we are done. careful when you put it back push down the plastic clip that's it put the seat cover on it that would be the whole procedure for this Hitachi screen thank you for watching